welcome to the new chapter. Before, let me remind you, stay home, stay safe and keep social distancing. Today, we are going to learn a wonderful chapter, an extract from a classical novel written by Charles Dickens called A Christmas Carol. You may have learned some of the extracts of this novel in the previous classes. So it will be easy for us to understand Ebenezer Scrooge and his behavior. This extract is the last part of the novel and we will see what are the changes have taken place in the life of Ebenezer Scrooge, the cold hatted miser. To understand this extract better, we have to know what all things happened previously. Ebenezer Scrooge was visited by three ghosts last night. Ghost of Christmas past, Ghost of Christmas present and Ghost of Christmas yet to come. And he understood how cruel he has become. So he thought to mend his behavior. So what are the changes that he adapted to his life is the summary of the extra that we are going to read. Ebenezer Scooch, his nephew Fred and his clerk Bob Cratchit, what all things happen to their life. Come, let's celebrate Christmas with Ebenezer Scrooge and wish you a happy Christmas. The extract begins with Scrooge inquiring, what's day today? A boy replies to him that was the Christmas day. So Scrooge realized that he had not missed the day because the previous night he had seen three visions about his childhood, his present life and his burial. So he realized that they were only just dreams. Scrooge asked the boy to get a turkey from the butcher shop for him. He offers some money to the boy as a reward. He bought it not for him but his clerk Bob Cratchit as his Christmas gift. Scrooge wrote Bob's address in a paper and asked the man to deliver it to then itself. On request, Scrooge asked him to get a cab to deliver the turkey to Bob. He also pays a lot more which was not his habit. Seeing his change towards money, he himself laughed inwardly a lot. Scrooge dusted himself all in his breast and at last go out into the streets. On the way to church, Scrooge met a gentleman. The gentleman visited Scrooge the day before for the donation to the poor, but then he rejected him. But after the ghost visit, Scrooge repented on it and gave him some amount of money. He was very much happy to receive such a donation and he really wondered by the change in his behavior. He went to church and talked to whom he met there. It was not his nature, but the previous night experiences and vision changed him a lot. Afternoon, he visited his nephew's house who was invited him for the Christmas party to the house last day. He asked to a girl where her master is and she took him to the upstairs and Scrooge reached their dining room. The old family was extremely happy to receive Scrooge to the Christmas dinner. They were really surprised to see him. The next morning, Scrooge was waiting for Bob in his office because he was late. Scrooge asked Bob the reason for his late coming. Bob replies that he won't repeat anymore and he justified that it was because of the Christmas celebrations. Feeling sorry to Bob, Scrooge promised that he will raise his salary to help his struggling family. Bob was very much happy and surprised to see his change. The last line of the story, Scrooge became as a good friend, as a good master, as good a man, as the good old city knew and any other world knew. 
hope you understood the chapter very well read learn and enjoy follow the description to get the summary word meaning and the question answer of this chapter thank you